Adrian, this is just going to be a quick update and then I'm going to get to bed. We've all been pulling double watches to help keep eyes and ears on the blob. Well, that's what I'm calling it anyway. Everyone else is referring to it as the boxes. But I say that we are not close enough yet to see if it really is a series of boxes. I mean, why not start out more simply and then we can refine the name as we go along. We'll start out with blob and move up to boxes and then on to... I don't know. Maybe drippy. And... Oh god. It won't be drippy, will they? We don't really know though, do we? Of course, they may not let us near enough to see them anyway. Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself here. I forgot to tell you. We can see them. Well, they're a spaceship anyway. If it is a spaceship, I still say it's a blob until proven otherwise. It could be, you know, just a big chunk of rock. I'm sorry. Did I mention we've been pulling double watches? my idea, I can tell you that much. I mean, what do they think this thing is going to do? It has waited for us for the better part of a year. But I'm going to wait a few more weeks. Yeah, a few weeks. Well, that's how long it's going to take to slow the Heracles down so we don't go plowing into the nebula. <laughs> I'm sure in that time we may come up with all sorts of new names for them. I don't know. How about Gooey Magoo? Well, the entire thing could be made of gelatin. Could. Well, I am starting to bore myself, so I certainly must be boring you. I just need you to relay a message to my publisher. Do you think you can handle that? Whatever these things are up here, we are eventually going to meet them. Let's face it, extraterrestrial biology will not actually exist until that meeting takes place. And when it does, all of my published works in the field will be grossly obsolete. That's why I'm going to begin working on new volumes on our way back home. I should have them ready for publication by the time we dock. Or land. Which is... Well, it doesn't matter. The, the important thing is, as long as Kunar cannot play his bagpipes, I should have a couple ready for publication by the time we get home. Can you relay all of that? I mean, spin it however you want, Adrian. Just reassure them that the Dr. Branch catalogue of books will continue to fuel their gravy train, with an increase in residuals, of course. Well, it is time for this author to rest his weary brain cells. Thanks very much for the help, love. Cheers. <laughs>